you know, she told me I had to stop associating um, violence with love. Yes. And this 100% plays a part in how I was raised. My dad was very physically abusive. My grandmother was very physically abusive. Um, a, a lot of people in my life were very physically abusive. And in, I, in a lot of relationships, including the one I think you're leading up to that was physically abusive, there's this mind that they tell you, and I've heard it so many times growing up, and they're like, well, if I wouldn't do it if I didn't care. Yeah. The he, fact that you can you. get this yeah. reaction from me means I love you that much or I care that much. And I honestly believed that for the longest sure. time. So, yeah, I mean, I 100% associated violence with love. Like, I, I thought if you weren't doing stuff like that, then you didn't care about me. I have, a, I have a friend. She was consistently cheated on by her boyfriend. And she confused. Her wires got crossed where she started to, to confuse him cheating on her with him being a high-value male. And I've seen the same thing where a woman, woman is like, oh, oh, he hits me because he loves me, right? They get, they get confused. And for someone who's never experienced this, it sounds so obvious yeah. and so crazy. And they're like, how, do, how did you not see it? How, like nobody understands unless they've experienced it, the mental rewiring and just yes. psychology behind somebody who has been with somebody who's physically abusive, narcissist, like it is a mind f that's yeah. the only word I can think of to describe it. And you, you don't know a difference.